So it's five o'clock in the morning. I'm headed to Cars and Coffee. Hurry up. You're curling your hair? It's five o'clock in the morning. No one's it's... gonna look at your hair. Shut up. You, you are. The fans are. I'm looking at it. Caperness. Okay, How are you awake right now? I'll see you downstairs. Ah! You should be beautiful. Come here, give me a kiss. See you, Capron. See ya. Bye, Capricorn. So I guess you guys didn't miss it. We revealed Mystery Girl. If you haven't checked it out, check it out. Yeah, check it out. Yeah, check out my girlfriend. Sometimes the smallest things in the world can make people happy. There you go. Thank you. So the place we're going to is Cars and Coffee, and it's in Elisa Vieja. Elisa Vieja? I've been wanting to go to Cars and Coffee for a long time, and this is the first time I'm gonna go to. Huh? How did he just pull yeah, off right now? Tanner, he always ignores me. Oh, there's my Uber. I was waiting for my Uber. Right here. That might not be it. I think they realized they forgot me, so they're coming to pick me up again. Look at the little wing they put on the front of it. Really curious if this thing actually goes like super fast now because of all the wings it has. Oh, if you could see inside here. Oh my God, that's so souped up. What M3. <laughs> We've been here for like 30 minutes. One. You ready? Yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> yeah, actually, Do you want it? Nah. Nah, we want to come. Kind of mainstream. We want a veggie. Come on. Something, something. Dad, you got me my Ferrari. <laughs> and I'm going to take her to do a daycare so she can be all. Oh, look at that one. <laughs> no. They want a hug. Oh, it's alright. That's a hug. Fan hug. Oh my god, look at the scooter. So basically from here we're gonna head out. I'm gonna head to a Lamborghini dealership where there's another kind of show going on. Thinking you can wing it? I love this car. The thing honestly sounds like a boat. I've honestly never heard a car that loud before. And it's so loud that you don't hear any noise going on around you. So we're on our way to a Lamborghini dealership and I've never been to a Lamborghini dealership before. So I'm pretty excited and they're having a car show there. Uh, I heard there's gonna be like... We just made it here. And it seems pretty gnarly already. I mean, there's cops everywhere. Look at that. That one really caught my eye. You caught like my crazy. eye. <laughs> Thank you. Some of these cars are just ridiculous.
under it, yeah? Yeah. You just go right under it. filmed some stuff that didn't have the mic on and I missed a lot of stuff and two cars got pulled over because their cars were so loud and I'm sad that I didn't get it but the cops pulled them over for showing their car and I just thought it was really stupid that they pulled people over for showing off their car I mean that's what a car show is about and a cops come up and just kind of just do that that's just it, I just feel like that's really low of cops to do that Cops are here to serve and protect us, not, you know, ruin a car show for the people that want to watch it and for the people that want to show off their cars, not be able to show it off. I just, I really want to speak my mind in that area. Come on, really, come on. I'm, I'm going to try to get a couple more cars taken off. Genesis takes it away with all the attention. Yo! Yeah. You the man! That guy just got a ticket for ripping it and I missed it because of all the audio was off. That made me so sad. I love your car. That's what I want. That's nice. Oh. It like hurts my heart that I missed all that footage for you guys because I mean I come out here and I like I work so hard to get all that ang all the angles, want to get it all right and I missed it and I just feel so bad. Come on. Wow. So they're not taking off because there's a cop right there and they'll pull over anybody that goes fast, which is really messed up because this is a car show. Have a good one, Danny. Not in the street. Get out of here, dude. Guys, trolling so hard. I don't blame half these guys for not taking off anyways because, I mean, these cops are trolling everyone. I'm surprised they have such a dip right here at a Lamborghini dealership so that you buy a Lamborghini and you leave and you go, oh, here's a, here's a scrape. Yeah. Your new Lamborghini. I do not like that troll. I don't like you. I think we're doing a Hawaiian dance. I'm not sure which one this is, but I've done it before. Okay, but we got a swing and lay. Oh, I don't know what that is. That's new stuff. Sure, dab, dab, dab it. <laughs> Tanner! A 16 year old owns one of those. How does that make you feel? Wait, he's 17 now. But still, good job, Tanner. That was nothing. He rolled away. Oh, uh, my car's only two years behind. Red line, let's go, buddy. Come on. Come on, do it for the GTI squad. Wow. <laughs> Yeah! 
Yeah! The hydraulic handbrake. That is amazing. A big lever you pull so the car will slide out. How hungry are you? From one to zero. Zero. Zero? Damn, she's pretty hungry. We should go eat. Okay, so the Lamborghini behind me. This guy ordered this thing a year ago and it just arrived like the other day and he wanted to come pick it up during the show. Souped up a special order, so it took over a year to make it. Okay, so I walk up to my car right now and I have a citation right here for $111.50 because I parked here and it says I need it says I need a permit or a guest permit and I see no signs here telling me that I need a permit to park here. It says no signs at all, nowhere. Look at this. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. This is not right. Okay. I love people. I just walked up to this house right over here on the left. And I went, excuse me, I got a parking ticket. I asked them if I can get a parking permit, like a guest parking permit. And uh, they gave me one and I said, that was the kindest thing. They didn't even hesitate at all. So I handed them 20 bucks and I said, thank you so much. And uh, they said, if, they, if I had any problems, here's the number. I just really want to say thank you to those people out there that are helping people that are in need of a stupid parking ticket like this. Seems like there was a big accident over here. So like, do you think the guy didn't make it? He hit in the intersection. See, he would hit down here. You think he's done? Well, they're pretty by what they're doing. Yeah. Judging by what they're doing? Okay, this is the car with the accident on it. Left. No, you're fine. You're fine. Okay, so that's the car with the accident. So basically what we're thinking would happen. Came out of the parking lot is what happened. Oh, wait, they did? And the did? guy just slammed into the back of him. Ooh, ooh, I guess I'm